Good evening and welcome to the 2017 St. Francis Holiday Hoops Classic. St. Francis will have it, breaking the press, Cameron Ng in the court, and it's blocked by Malsov. Kuali Moy finds Ning again down the court, and he gets the basket with the contact. Ron, you know, he said that he is like another co coach on the floor. He leads on the court, tells people where to go, and you can definitely see um, Hosoda picks it up and goes with it. But he turns it away again, and here's Tanovasa. Gets it to Ning up the floor, and the score is tied 11-11 with 2.12 to play in the first quarter. Kita gets free, finds Chong in the corner for three, and it's good. Now he's such a dangerous guy when he can step up and shoot. Um, sometimes I wonder why he handles the ball, but as we talk about shooting, here's Cameron. They're not being as aggressive as they have been in the past. Just a Cordell Ning loses it, and here's Puno running. They got numbers. Chong gets it in. The Hawaiian Electric boys basketball rankings down by eight points, which is whittled down to six after Cole Arsenal's bucket. Gets it out back. His follow tail from three, and it's good. The part of the game where St. Francis is going to need somebody not named Ng to step up for them. Oh. They're not as aggressive on the defensive end, but as I say that, they get a steal. Here's Cameron Ng. Hop steps in the lane. A little short. Kunaho survives the turnover. Falatea with a little behind the back. It's stolen. Here's Cordell Ning. Goes straight at Arsenal. No foul, but he gets the tough layup to go. And the Saints go up by three. Falatea to Cordell Ning. Tries to get it to Nishida, but it's stolen by Hosoda. Here's Zane Chong up the floor. Scoop shot no good, but Makala's there on the follow. They have a really good night at the free throw line, only going one for six. Uh, Punahou as a whole only shot nine for 18, but they get the turnover, and Makala goes to the rim. He gives them Punahou jumper. You know, it's another lefty going to his right. Cordell Ning breaks the press, goes in for the layup. He has now 11 points. Gotta stop the dribble there. Can't just let him go wherever he wants. Kala goes baseline, nice dump off to Clemens. Clemens gets on the board for his six points of the game. Kuno gets a strip on the rebound, and it's their ball. Chong for three, and it's good. You can't give him that many chances. Arsenal makes a second shot to give the Punoho Buffalo Blue a three point lead. But here's the Saints. And Tufono draws a charge on Kuni Boy to prevent the easy basket on the fast break. They're, they're riding him a little bit, they're letting, but they're letting that go, so they have to adjust. Makala with a fake pass to Tufono, but he hits it from outside the arc. And it's an eight half court. Gets a screen from Akana. Goes around. Ooh, great block by Malsa, but Vukovic is there. Great heads up play by Vukovic to get the offensive rebound from beyond the arc. Yeah, I'll give him credit for that. It's Cordell Ning. Gets it to Bubba Akana. Akana with his six points off the bench. But St. Francis gets. Good, but he gets his own miss. Cordell Ng. Coaches. Not, not like Soda. Gets in the lane. Dump off past the McCollum. McCollum's shot is good. He's got 20. Left McCollum wide open. Rashida's three is good. That's a long three, and they're going to body each other up. He's got some words for him. And that is it. <laughs> Getting chippy here. Gets it back. Goes down the alley. Straight up, the gut, gets the basket and the contact. Yeah, very aggressive to start the third quarter. Mm -hmm. Here he goes down the middle and gets the basket. Boy, that's a tough finish there by Ng. Hang. Yeah, they go to McCullough in the post. McCullough shot up in the third. Nice 
93 seconds left to go. Mossad blocked by Nishida. Plays really hard. He's in there for his defense. Oh, Cameron Ng hits a three. It's a six-point game with 31.6 left in the ball game. This game is not. Cameron Ng shot no good at the buzzer. And Punahou will win this matchup, 74 to 66. Punahou defeats the fifth-ranked St. Francis Saints by eight. Very exciting game.